The letter Q exits the command page. Now I mentioned that the More Man page is found in section number one. There are eight sections. There's no need for me to list what they all are here because you wouldn't remember them, but I can show you how to find out what each one of them is. Just enter the man command, a section number, and the word intro, and the man page displayed will be a page introducing that section. For example, Now it can happen that you have the same name documented in two different sections. You can select the one you want by specifying the section number. For example, the make directory command mkdir to create a directory is documented in section 1. You don't have to specify a number because man starts its search in section 1 and displays the first one it finds. However, to display the version of this command found in section 2, you will need to specify that section number this way. Notice that in the synopsis there are a couple of include file lines and the syntax of a function call. That's because section 2 of the man pages lists the C language system calls, and this is how you create a directory from inside a program. If you want to know more about MAN and how to use it, you can take a look at the MAN page for MAN this way. Now there is a secondary documentation system that comes with Linux. It was developed for use by those who use the Emacs text editor, and it requires that you learn a lot of control codes to be able to navigate your way through it. It's not a simple matter of scrolling up and down like with the MAN pages. The layout of the documentation in info is based on text menus and navigation controls. Entering H for help gives you this list of controls. As you can see, there are lots of controls. Later on, we'll be looking into the Emacs text editor, and if you elect to learn the editor, you'll also be learning the keystrokes required for the info documentation system. Things move fast and there's no controlling standard over documentation, so you may wind up searching for a bit to find your information. A good place to start an internet search is the Linux Documentation Project, which is at www.tldp.org. There's a link to it on that web page that I gave you earlier.